Hey y'all, welcome back to our house. Season with your ever luscious hostess, Loretta Jingles. That'd be two beers, please. <laughs> Since my inbox forever loaded up, I decided I'd take some real letters to people to load. Water bill, electricity bill, dead renter's disability check. Oh, look here what we got here. Dear Loretta, my fancy here. We loves how you love the gays and you are a reason for getting up in the morning. <laughs> Would you ever consider marrying us when we get hitched next spring? Oh, that's so sweet. No. But let me tell you why. I'm happy. The guys all got like rights and citizenship and shit. But that don't take away from one universal monumental truth, and that is marriage is for the fucking birds. And by and by and, and um birds, they got swine flu. I just on this thing marriage is fucking Deep power to know. Shit, seriously, there ain't no reason to have marriage in the first place if you got a good relationship. If you into that penguin, pairing up bullshit. If you need the government to give you a paper to say you eternally link to whoever, I mean, seriously, I feel sad for you. And let me answer to all every man and lesbian and drunk gay out there with every eyes for my hand. Hold up and let me unveil a colorful list of responses. I rather a list of I rathers. <clears throat> Number one. I'm ready to put my titty in a meat grinder and grind it up in a hamburger while Taylor Swift sang one million bottles of beer on the wall. I'd rather deep throat a plugged in hot curling iron than to get married. Number three, I would vote Republican before I get married. Number four, I'd rather burn down on a cat than to get a, uh, than to, than to, than to, to get hitched. I'd rather eat food. I'd rather lick a midget. I'll be right back. I gotta go throw up. In, in other in other words, no, not no. Nah, I ain't, I ain't get, I ain't no marriage ain't for love. Yeah, I walk down that ignorant plank a time or two, and guess what? Marriage makes people think they can control you. They make you lose your sense of self. They make you give up your sense of independence and motivation. They make you code opinion. They make you blind to the fact that they just using you to get a fucking green card or they want a Barbie doll to stand next to them so don't nobody know that you a coke addict and you executive vice president of a multi-million dollar company. <laughs> And listen, you know what else you can do, you a publican? I mean, if you married, you can't just break up. You had to go to this whole rigmarole of the lawyers and alimony, child support, and bullshit, and bullshit, and bullshit. I mean, who the fuck need all that? None of them. Five percent of the marriages that get married is getting divorced anyway, stupid motherfucker. So quit getting married. If y'all happy, they they probably did lend them an Annie. 
Kids, sons, marriage, all they think this is they got to bury populate and give them babies and and then we got this overpopulation problems and everybody didn't wait dirty diapers and shit shit. Oh man, I know they suppose how they're going I'm out just strong and I believe it. Uh, let me tell y'all something. Good for you. Get your own show what's called I Love Being Married. This and here's the man. How many goats y'all think I'd be worth in the Odin Day of Marriage? Hmm? How many? I think it would be a lot. Well, fuck you. Y'all don't never answer me. Everybody ordered this to be single and free and fuck the institutions. They just made it so cousins can marry up with cousins and keep the land in the family name. That's nicey. Oof. They try to cut me in, bro. Hey, y'all, if I croak tomorrow, y'all just remember one thing. Don't fucking never, 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 never get fucking married, okay? It's as fun as a needle in a pee hole. <laughs> I already know. That's how I say it.